What's going on guys? My name is Fizz. How's everyone doing today? We are back with some more Horizon stuff. I know I haven't been covering it that much because I've been very busy with ARK, but we're finally going to be covering it a lot now. Anytime there's information, I want to definitely talk about it. We're going to be talking about this brand new creature and also a little trailer. So let's go watch that and give my reactions because uh, there's been a lot of new Horizon stuff happening in the news. And honestly, we're getting really close to launch a couple months, so I'm super excited. Let's see what it looks like. Let me make my camera a little smaller. I haven't seen this yet. The Forbidden West. Oh, wow. From the ruins of the old ones to its sunken depths. Yo, if the water physics look like that good, this is going to be best water physics the machines. game ever. They Looks so gorgeous. Forests. Wow. Redwood Forest, Always dude. On guard as they scavenge Monkey the dudes. Soak up the sun to patrol the sky. Roam the land Ooh. to protect its treasures. Each more dangerous than the last. The strongest. Look at that, dude. Only to kill. In the raptor. It is said there are those who can harness them, even bend them to their will. A powerful secret. That in the wrong hands. <laughs> to a storm of destruction. Not seen since the time of the old ones. Dude, it looks so freaking good absolutely incredible all right so we're gonna do a quick recap of a lot of images from twitter because they've been sharing a lot of stuff so number one this is like kind of it looks like to be an old solar power plant but it looks like a bunch of uh who honestly knows some uh, indigenous tribe has taken it over and uh it's using it <laughs> as their base of operation looks pretty cool looks amazing i love that we're getting a desert theme uh once again we also got the strider thing in the background pretty damn freaking cool uh this one we're riding one of those uh oh god i forgot what those are called um they're, they're like the bull thing and then we got the little tyrannid on things we actually have uh fox so we know animals are back probably because that's you know that's the way you're gonna upgrade your gear just like the first one but this is a beautiful little shot again here we go look at this beautiful dude this thing is like a staple i hope they make like a massive statue of one of these maybe for the the third one you know because we're getting the mammoth for this one but this one you can see all the battle droids that are in the background right here from the old war uh which is really cool that's really sweet this is a fantastic shot look at this scenery dude look at the sky it looks so good oh my goodness and then lastly the big freaking bird is back i hate this thing i i remember fighting this in the first one the first time it was really hard and after you figured out like where its weak points and stuff were it wasn't too bad but starting out it's probably going to be a really pain but i love how it's coming back once again uh and yes i forgot all the names it's been a long time since i played horizon but i played it twice now at this point all right so the one i really wanted to talk about which we'll get out of the way is the the new cobra snake and bot mm, my, mm, I don't, mm, I, words cannot describe how cool this is like the art director direction for this thing is absolutely incredible i mean look at this you got the fangs you got the cobra uh Burnt, uh, what are these fins? I guess you call them coming out and everything during an even trailer. Look at all this like magnetic like stuff that like grinds pieces up together. It's truly incredible detail. And this right here probably might might be one of my next new favorite creatures to uh, to be honest fight. <laughs> but also um, 
you know, have a statue of, because that'd be really cool. Then we have another shot of, actually, it's kind of a good two shot. So let me let me hide my camera real quick, because you can see the this guy right here. So this, uh, I guess you could call them more of uh, tappies, more pteranodon tappies, I guess you could call them. Uh, beautiful solar panel wings kind of going on. Uh, obviously, they said that in the little video that they, they you know, go up and uh, collect sun rays to be able to be powered and longer generate. So that's why they can fly a lot more and then also we have a beautiful shot of this new armor uh which looks incredible by the way i'm not gonna lie now for me even when i played the witcher okay in the last game um i like to wear very traditional armor i don't like to look like super weird and everything but you know this is this this is not bad you know this is not bad to wear around i don't know why i like to be i like to look like the part you know what i mean so pretty cool incredible shot also one of the um big big mecha droid things again in the background pretty damn cool all right and lastly this is like kind of an armadillo in a way um it sh can shed these scales you can call them i guess but then also retract them back and then also has a roll ability so it's pretty interesting and cool with all these new different mechanics it can do uh here is also a beautiful shot of this brand new armor i mean this is really nice this is like some really nice armor look at the detail on this like incredible look at the bow like this is why I love this game, dude. I cannot wait for this game. I'm more excited for this game than anything else, but it looks incredible. And the mech looks amazing. I'll hide my camera real quick so you guys can see it again. Absolutely incredible details. I mean, man, this, this company, dude, they make some freaking amazing mechs, I tell you. All right, and there's one more thing on the Twitter I wanted to go through. We got this guy. It's kind of like more of a, uh, I guess you could call it a Capro. I'm going to be real. Capro or, Sar or Sarko, but we already have kind of a Sarko or Dinosuchus already in the game. Um, so this is more of like a Capro. It's more of a lunge thing. And also it shows off the really cool dodge mechanic that we can do in the water and the breathing apparatus that she's wearing, Aloy's wearing. I mean, it's pretty cool. It looks like a bunch of pipes and stuff kind of hanging off. Uh, and uh, what, uh, what else is there? It's like a couple pipes and something else to like attach to it. But the Capra dude is actually really cool. It kind of reminds me of the uh, Watcher guys, but it's like a bigger version of them. But yeah, it looks pretty, pretty uh, water mechanic wise. And yeah, this looks really cool. I guess yes, ladies, and gentlemen, boys and girls, that's it. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you like, subscribe, and follow on the top right, which is that way over there. You can check out my review of the pre-orders. I've already pre-ordered. I will be doing an unboxing of the mammoth. Uh, I got one of the mammoth. And also, one of my admins. <laughs> Look what I got. <laughs> this thing is massive. I am so happy I got this. This is the Lockjaw from the first game. And it's freaking amazing. It's so cool. So big. So that's it. If you enjoyed the video, whoa, camera. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you like, subscribe, and follow. I'll keep you guys up to date now with Horizon News in the future. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one.